Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel, Poverty Hill Adventures. This video is going to be another video in the Tent Camp Journal series. Well, this morning is just uh, a beauty of a morning. It's a little chilly, but it's going to warm up and uh, blue skies and very little wind would have been a perfect morning to go turkey hunting except for I overslept <laughs> I had all good intentions of getting up uh, and uh, getting out there before uh, sunrise and it didn't work out I uh, I must have been more tired than I thought uh, last night was a, a clear and cold night it was good sleeping weather I had the little uh wood stove going in the tent and uh i was down in my sleeping bag and i just plain overslept so uh, i'm gonna go to plan b after i uh get things situated a little around here I'm gonna go do some fishing today Got an addition to the outdoor kitchen at tent camp, and I moved uh, I moved this old uh, box stove uh, from the Hobo Hilton over to tent camp, and I used the, the the deer cart to do it. Let me tell you what this thing this thing is heavy. And there's a little friend of mine <laughs> stopping by. <laughs> He don't seem to be bothered too much by uh, by tent camp here. I spotted these mushrooms uh, when I was taking a walk the other day and I had never seen a, uh, mushrooms like that uh, before. They looked like morels except for the color and for a minute I thought well maybe they're morels but <laughs> as is with mushrooms you got to be super careful. What they are, I looked them up is I believe what they are is false morels you can tell by the color and they are toxic <laughs> so again if you're not sure about mushrooms uh, I wouldn't recommend eating them Time to wake up. The birds are beginning to sing outside. And that's kind of like my alarm clock. It's probably about 5 o'clock or so. busy day ahead of me the weather is not looking uh, 
all that great. Supposed to have a chance of rain and uh, much cooler than yesterday. And I, uh, like I said, I got a busy day. I volunteered. I signed up uh, to uh, do some volunteer work at uh, a local uh, state park. Uh, where I do a lot of fishing and hunting. And uh, I don't know what jobs they got planned, uh, but uh, I'll be there and I'll, I'll give it my best effort to, to help them out. I uh, got to the volunteer <laughs> location just a little early. <laughs> It don't start for a couple of hours, so uh, I got my fishing pole with me. So I'm gonna do a little uh, fishing uh, beforehand. Wouldn't you know it, <laughs> I, uh, I lost a couple of MEPS uh, spinners here, so I think I'm just going to head back to the spot where we're all supposed to meet. Uh, <laughs> I have the worst luck with snags, you know. I have my assignment. My assignment is to pick up litter uh, around uh, a certain area. They gave me an area and I'm on my way to that area right now. Got my garbage picker upper and a big black bag to put all the trash in. Well, so far, <laughs> I gotta have the cleanest section in, in, the, in the whole place. Uh, I have found Zero litter, but I'm still searching. <laughs> I came to work, I came to help out, and I'm going to find some litter uh, one way or the other. I got all excited. I thought I found some litter. <laughs> it turns out it was a, a feathers from some poor songbird that a hawk or an owl or whatever got. I told you I'd find some litter. <laughs> I've been uh, walking around. The place is uh, immaculate, but I did find something to pick up. Well, I got my first section all picked up. Uh, it was not very messy. I got to give uh, the staff here at the park and the visitors to the park a, uh, a tip of the hat because uh, there was very little litter. I'm going to go to... The second location that they gave me to uh, pick up. This is my second spot, starting on the uh, entrance way into the park uh, from the overlook. It overlooks uh, the city of Salamanca. And I'm going to clean from here to the uh, park entrance. I finished up my my two spots <laughs> and I still got some time and the uh, nice lady that's in charge of uh, the whole program uh, suggested that I go up uh, to location number three and I'm on my way there and uh, maybe we'll uh, maybe we'll find some trash up here <laughs> we're heading up a gravel road here to a place called Bee Hunter Trail. I've never been up here. Uh, we'll see what's uh, 
what's up here. I think there's some cabins up here, some rental cabins. Well, I got a, another fella and uh, his daughter stopped by to help, and uh, we're not finding much uh, in the way of garbage. Uh, I'm working from one end towards the middle, and he's working from the other end with his daughter towards the middle, and uh, I uh, think that'll probably be just about it for today. I think for now, I'm just gonna sit back here and commune with nature and relax. So until next time, everybody, take care. Thank you for watching. Remember to keep on trucking and believe in yourself even when no one else does.